Hello, I want to tell you about the Christingle. This is a Christingle. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to light it safely. Watch how I light it. So I take the Christingle and I tip it, up, tip it up on its side and I put the, can, the end of the candle in the flame and now the Christingle is lit. Now the Christingle is there to remind us about the love of God, the love that God has for the whole world. And this orange is round like the world, so that's the world in the Christingle, and the candle is the light of the world. Who is the light of the world? Jesus is the light of the world. That's what it says in John's Gospel. And this red ribbon that's tied round the orange, it reminds us of the blood of Jesus, because Jesus died to save the world. And you see these little bits of fruit, there's a, there's a raisin on there. Uh, sometimes people have sweets instead of fruit, but really it should be fruit because they remind you of the fruit of the Spirit. Because what happened after Jesus um, died and rose again from the dead is that the Spirit of God came upon the world and it entered into our hearts. And so we have the Spirit of God inside us. And this Spirit is working in us and it's working in the world and it makes us do good things. It makes us do the things that God wants us to do. And these things that God wants us to do are called the fruit of the Spirit. What are those things? Well, they're all the things that we do when we love each other. Loving each other, that's the fruit of the Spirit. So there's the Christingle. The orange is the world. The candle is Jesus, the light of the world. The ribbon is his blood because he died to save the world. And the fruit are the fruit of the Spirit, which is all the people in the world loving each other. That's how it works.